Hello, I'm Senator Tom Harkin, and I sure regret that I can't be with you in Long Beach, but I do appreciate this opportunity to join you by video. A greetings first to APSI Board President David Hoff, your Vice President Susan Ryan, and Executive Director Laura Owens. And special greetings to Ashley Lance, Iowa's APSI President and sister of my good friend, Emily Hillman. Thank you so much for honoring me with your TORCH Award. Fostering employment of people with disabilities in competitive, integrated settings has been a large part of my life's work, and I am humbled by you recognizing me for those efforts. Of course, if I had my druthers, I'd be giving you folks an award for your own passionate commitment to promoting and helping people with disabilities to obtain competitive, integrated employment. Your great work day in and day out is so critical to making the goals of the Americans with Disabilities Act a reality for all people with disabilities. Almost a year ago, my Health, Education, Labor, and Pensions Committee developed and passed by an 18 to 3 bipartisan vote, I might add, a reauthorization of the Rehabilitation Act. Since then, my colleagues in both the Senate and House have been working diligently to pass that reauthorization. And I hope that by the time you hear this and see this video, we will have been successful. Our bill does some extraordinary things. First and foremost, it puts competitive integrated employment for people with disabilities where it should be, in first place, as the first option, as the first opportunity. A completed reauthorization will make it a priority to ensure people with disabilities get the education, experience, and opportunities to be successful in competitive, integrated employment. In addition, the bill reauthorizes the Supported Employment Program, a program many of you work on every day, a program that makes it possible for many people with disabilities to participate in the general workforce. So I thank those of you who have been supportive of our efforts to reauthorize the Rehabilitation Act, uh, the Rehab Act as we call it. But I'm even more thankful for the work you do every day. You recognize that work, true work, improves the health, well-being, and quality of life for those who participate in it. And your efforts ensure that people with disabilities are able to work, make their lives better, and be a contributing part of their communities. One of the best examples uh, of this is my friend, as I mentioned, Emily uh, Hillman. Uh, M operates with the help of her mother and others, M's Coffee Company in Independence, Iowa. Well, that's a great name for that town, Independence, Iowa, because M has shown her independence. With M's great personality forging the way, she employs people with and without disabilities and serves a great need in a town of about 6,000 people. She's a business person, an employer, and a taxpayer. She is exactly what all of you work to achieve in partnership with people with disabilities every single day. Now you should know there were some folks during the reauthorization process who wanted to get rid of the supported employment program. But we fought hard to keep it as a part of the Rehabilitation Act. And I know you will work hard to ensure that the program is well implemented and that it continues to match those with disabilities with good jobs and opportunities to reach the goals of independence and economic self-sufficiency. That was one of our posts uh, that we highlighted when we passed the ADA almost 24 years ago. So friends, your work and my work must always be premised on high expectations. We need to have confidence that all individuals can achieve and succeed and grow. And we must work to ensure that the opportunities and supports are available to transform those high expectations into reality. Of course, this is exactly how you define your work. And I can't say it enough. I deeply appreciate everything you do. The work you do is just about the most important work that I can imagine. So again, thank you for honoring me with your Torch Award. Thank you for being such great partners. I wish you all the best during your annual conference in California and by all means, a safe trip back home.